Chapter 19, Christmas Canisters. Johnny B was the number one space pirate. Well, not yet, but he really wanted to be. He actually was a pretty normal space miner who was thinking about a career change. What makes a space pirate grand, he asked. Was it having a sweet space gun, he wondered? Because all he had was a set of basic mining lasers. Was it flying into uncharted space territory? Because most of the space around had already been charted. Maybe it was having awesome pirate decals on the dashboard, because he didn't have any of those, and couldn't find them anywhere either. This wasn't surprising to most space travelers, of course. Johnny B's ship was so slow that by the time he got to any space station, all the decals were sold out, and all the good space pirate jobs were already taken. I'll never be a real space pirate, Johnny said in an email to himself, which actually was a pretty depressing way to go about doing that. One Christmas, while Johnny was writing one of those sad emails, he received a secret message from the downtown pirate crew recruiting a space pirate to carry some illegal cargo to the Serebrov station, docking port 19. This is my chance, Johnny B said, and he took the job and flew out of the station. He snuck past Federation patrols very slowly, hid from their scans, and maybe even outmaneuvered a battleship no one could know for certain. He had a close call with a planet and a sun, and within minutes of the desired delivery time, he arrived at the CD station on the far reaches of the space territory. But when he landed, he discovered the illegal cargo was actually holiday food, clothes, candies, and four canisters of Christmas spirit. You space dumby, Johnny said to himself in another email. What kind of pirate is tricked into bringing food and chocolates to helpless orphans? The best kind, the pirate captain Death Borlock sent in an encrypted email, along with a number one space pirate 3D printable mug schematic and some sick pirate decals. He even sent Johnny B a secret opportunity to map out the far reaches of the galaxy. So Johnny B unwittingly set off on the safest space pirate adventure ever in a ship so slow that no law enforcement would ever suspect a thing. Thank you.